great, you guys made it. I think it's time to get on ready. So the most important thing for me in my routine is makeup off. You know, you come home, you're tired, you don't want to do the whole routine, always take that makeup off. So that's always where I start. And I always like to hold the pad a little bit because I always wear waterproof makeup, or at least mascara, so I want to be gentle on my lashes. That's the last thing I want to pull out. And voila. <laughs> my next step will be my cleanser. Every day I cleanse my face. It's non-foamy, it's just for sensitive skin and like not irritating. I get so many different like products on every day. So I wanna just gently rub that in. And I usually take just a cloth, take some hot water on, and then I just wrap it up. My skin type is like kinda like a little bit over all over the place. Some days it's super sensitive because I've been traveling a lot in different makeups in different countries. Other days it dries out and sometimes it's super oily. So this one is just like, it is for sensitive skin because I find that that's the least irritating for me. So after the cleanser, I have this great product. Um, it's actually special made. It's like a little pad and it helps with toning out the skin when you have redness. When you go to these guys, they look at your skin and see what you're missing. So it's a mix of acid, antioxidants, and just enzymes. It almost feels like a mega wipe. You just slowly go over your face with it. Every morning and every night I use this little pad and I make sure to go down my neck, use it all over the face, and just treat the neck and the face as one. <laughs> this product I'm obsessed with. I found it in Paris when I started Fashion Weeks and I've been using it for the last seven years. I put it on flights or I put it on like I do right now before products to help it absorb better into the skin. I feel so good. You just kind of want to redo it, keep doing it. I actually have it in travel size in my bag as well, so I have it on me at all times. I love it. My next step would then be, and I actually, a lot of this routine I do in the morning and at night, it's a serum, but it's antioxidant. So it's kind of putting like a little mix of vitamin C and vitamin E on your face. <laughs> then one of my last steps would be my night cream. I love my night cream so much. It helps prevent wrinkles. I'm 25 now, so I gotta, you know, start doing that preventing stuff from happening, gravity, life, <laughs> anything. But my really fun thing lately I love to do is I just got starting to shave my face. And I know this is gonna sound scary, and at first I was like, what, don't do it. But my friends have been doing it for a long time since she really swears by it, her skin is cleaned out a lot. So I only do this once, max twice a week. You wanna avoid anything with a gel moisturizer, or the cooling or all that extra thing. You literally just wanna find the disposable ones. You wanna use it once, you wanna throw it out. And I would use the same cleanse as I did before. And then you just gently shave your face. I'm not gonna do that right now, but uh, also the first time, be careful. Put a finger here on your brows. You do not all of a sudden wanna look up and have no brows. When I have time and I want to treat my skin, I love to put on a mask. I was recently just in China and found these amazingly cute masks. They all have like different phases. And I once a week maybe put one on. I sit and watch a TV episode and I just have fun. I am now completely in my animal zone and I'm gonna go watch Animal Planet. Yeah, how does Otters vote? Well, I think it's like a... Oh. You know, gotta stay on here for 20 minutes. That's why I like to put on an episode of something normally. And now, you're all fully moisturized as you can see. And honestly, sometimes this is great just to sleep in. And I like to dab my face off because I've been told that I was too rough with my face and don't just rub it even though that's what I used to do. So now I'm like trying to learn to be gentle to my face. As a good little finish, I love to keep my lips moisturized too. You cannot forget that. And sometimes if your lips feels chapped or something, I like to take my toothbrush and just like scrub them. It's a perfect little scrub. And a weird thing I always finish with before I go to bed is I always put perfume on. It's the first thing I put on in the morning and the last thing I put on at night. I always do the cloud. You know, you spray it and you walk through it because I learned from one of the noses, the guys who create perfumes, that when you bring heat to it and you rub it here, 
you just change the whole scent of it. So I used to do that, but I don't do that anymore. So spray, cloud, walk through it. And that's it. That's my routine. And now I'm gonna watch some Netflix. I binge watch TV way too much.